Hello guys, welcome to We Race Diecast. My name is Dave and this is Builder Wars. Builder Wars is a tournament where the top builders can compete with each other in a battle of skill. Each event will have a different theme with different rules, different castings, and a different track. Today, we kick off event one, the zoom in. Four builders showed up each building four cars using only the zoom in casting. We will run a 16 car bracket tournament with four car groups, four races, and top two will advance to the next round. Races will be done on the 61 track. You don't want to miss it. If you like what you see, hit that subscribe button. Now let's meet the builders. First up, we got Thomas Filippiak. He's a veteran on the track, sending many cars to King of the 621, makes the finals every time, and he has a King title under his belt. I expect we'll see some solid racing from Thomas. Next up, we got Rami Rivera, another strong competitor. We have seen him twice on the 621 with two cars and two finals appearances. You might not have the nicest looking cars, but I guarantee they are fast. Then we got Nick Devers, a true veteran to diecast racing. He has been doing this for a long time, relatively new here on the 621, but he does have a king title under his belt with only two appearances. Last but not least, we have Keith Filippiak, Thomas's cousin, the Flip Cousins. Keith has been an absolute beast on the 621, with five king title wins, three for three cars winning the king title, near flawless on the track. We have groups one and two racing today, and as you can see, each builder has one car in every group. Only top two move on, so there's a potential for builders to lose all four cars in the first round. We'll just have to see how it plays out. All right, here we go with group one, race one. From left to right, you got Nick, Keith, Rami, and Thomas. Coming out of the gate, Rami was the quickest. Looks like he drips into Thomas. Hits the wall and it slows him down. Keith got the win. Not sure who got second there. I'd have to give it to ooh, Nick. Looks like Nick pulled it off. Let's see what the let's see what the officials say. Looks like they did give it to Nick. Big win for Keith. Any win with four races is a good win. Thomas with only one point, that's going to hurt. He's going to have to make up for that. Race two, here we go. Got Keith, Thomas, Nick, and Rummy. Rummy again out first. Veers off into the wall. Photo finish, who knows who won that one. Thomas, looks like Thomas pulled it out. He needed that. Wow, look how close that is. Super close race. Keith with seven. Both Nick and Thomas with six. Rami with three. Rami now needs the win. Rami now in trouble. He's going to have to get a good finish here. He needs the win. Rami's still the fastest out of the gate. Pushed into the wall by Keith this time. Doesn't look like he got the win though. Looks like Keith got it. Who got second? Thomas still second from them. Rami in third, Nick in last with one point. Another tight finish. Looking at the points, Keith in the lead with 12, while Thomas and Nick battle it out for second place. Rami not looking good. He can still get in. He's gonna need a win with the Thomas last place. Here we go, race four, this is it. Big Rami, can he do it? Out the gate in front. This time he pushes Keith and it looks like he got it. Yep, he got the win. 
but he needs a Thomas last place. And I don't think he got that. Looks like Thomas, yeah, he, Thomas gets third, and that's it. He misses it by a point. Both Keith and Thomas, the flip cousins, looks like they're moving on to the semifinals. And there you have it. Group one is in the books. The flip cousins moving on to the semifinals. Will Rami and Nick join them next week? We have Group 2 face off. Thanks again to everyone who watched at this point. This is our first commentated video. Please be patient as we learn the ropes. It's a brand new concept for us. Looking forward to making this a regular thing.